Welcome to Pride More Keep! This is Plague Knight! And we are gonna have some fun. Oof, that was close. Uh, let's do that. Golden fish, please. I guess Plague Knight is not as treasure hungry, does that even make sense, as Shovel Knight. Since, maybe this is my impression, but I feel like he doesn't collect as much treasure. Although, to be fair, maybe he just has more, maybe he just has more stuff to buy. Um, wait for it. Oh! Careful now. Careful now. <laughs> hmm. Okay. I'm too tall for that. Well, we're dead now. Next stop. Oh, hey, save point. I could probably smash this save point and make a little extra money. I think I can probably get away with that. Um, yeah, let's do that. Gotta buy those potions somehow, after all, right? Uh, fighting these guys is so much better with Plague Knight! Just keep throwing bombs at them! Okay, uh... I see that treasure there. Wait, is there a... Aha! Gotta make sure you look for those things. They are pretty important. And actually, I forgot to mention this last episode, but... If we collect... If you collect every single alchemy coin... Wait, is that what they're called? Cypher coin. If you collect every single cypher coin, you get a... You get, basically, you get chaos mode. Um, which is really fun, but honestly, I will probably not get, simply because... Okay, well, first of all, there are cypher coins in the b final boss stage, so... That's sort of a new... That sort of makes it a new game plus only thing. Proposition. Right... Right there. All in its own. Uh, beyond that, though... Beyond that, uh... Okay. <laughs> uh... Realistically, I'm probably gonna miss at least a couple Cypher Coins. I'm not perfect. Uh, I don't remember where every single coin is. And there's a lot of coins. I mean, I'll get most of them. I'll buy- I will for sure buy every regular upgrade. But 
I'm not holding my breath on the, uh... I am not holding my breath on the other ones. <laughs> the non-regular upgrades, as it were. Okay, so... I mean, it is Shovel Knight shape, but, uh, maybe we can just, uh... Aha! Poured in a beaker and stuff in a bag, Chester's always gotten swag! Hey, nice relic, pal! Would... You know, I could take that off your hands. And give you something a little more interesting. Wouldn't it, Did I pick up a relic? Oh, I did... When did I pick that up? Obviously I wasn't paying close enough attention. Uh... Here's how Plug Knight stuff works. We find the relics that Shovel Knight... Uh, that Chester eventually sells to Shuffle Knight, and we trade them to Chester. For... Uh, more useful things. For Arcana! Cause like, uh, well... Yeah. That is actually a pretty useful one. In fact, I think generally... Uh... Whoops. Good thing I grabbed the save point. Um... I think generally, Plague Knight's Arcana is more useful than Shovel Knight's Relics. Which isn't to say Re Shovel Knight's Relics are useless, but there are three or four outlier relics that just sort of put the other ones to shame. Like, Shovel Knight only really needs the Propeller Blade, the, his, the Potion Relics, and maybe the Fire Wand. Other than those, he can get by just fine without them. Oh, actually, I guess he's... Hmm. Outside of, like... Oh, actually, no. The Phase Locket as well is important, come to think of it. Still, my point is, outside of rare scenarios, only about three of the relics are really useful for play for uh, Shovel Knight. But Plague Knight sort of goes both ways with that. The average usefulness of his Arcana, I would say, is higher, but also there's less... But also, there are fewer uh, Breakout Arcana. Like, there are no... Oh, whoops. <laughs> I would say there are no Arcana that really put... Uh, whoops. That really put the other ones to shame. That was really bad. <laughs> I can blow this stuff up with impunity nap this time, because I can reach the... I can do this. Okay. Oh, I forgot that's what those do. No, I was I was sort of half right. Um, they do heal you, but they also give you... I'm pretty sure you only get three, um, three containers doing that. But obviously those containers go away if you die. So, you know, keep that in mind. Close. <laughs> Way too close. Hmm. There we go. 
let's, uh, there we go. And explode, please. Treasure. Oh, well, I missed that treasure. Yeah, I think it is worth saying, in case it is not yet obvious, Plug Knight does have the more mobility, but, like, his rank of jump is definitely worse than Shovel Knight. Like, this, with the double jump, I, th I want to say is slightly shorter than Shovel Knight's regular jump, but that X that double jump just gives you so much more control. It's great. One second. Okay, I suppose it was nothing. I definitely want that one, because I'm going to do something stupid on this part. Uh, <laughs> but, uh, let, let's grab the stuff in here first. Okay, that is not what I was actually talking about when I said I was going to do something stupid. <laughs> Uh, close enough. No. Thi well, wait. Wait for it. Yeah, I mean, I want the thing. Otherwise, I would have been- The stupid thing I would have been doing would have been trying to get across here in a single jump. Which is totally- Oh, well, I died. Uh, I was saying, which is totally doable. Ah, uh, man, that is actually a really bad place to die, too. <laughs> I'm gonna lose all my freaking treasure here. Oh no! <laughs> I was hoping to put off the Plague Knight incompetence a little bit longer than this, to tell the truth. I don't think I can get that treasure from here. Maybe if I... Oh, this is okay. This is okay. We got it. <laughs> Thank you. 
Okay. Aw, oh, man. That was bad. Uh, oh, hey, Griffin! I would say I've collected close to 30 Cypher Coins. Maybe just straight up 30. Wait a second. 30 out of 30. 420 total. Okay. Hello, King Knight. Leg Knight! You double-crossing constable! Constable of Crucibles? Really? <laughs> Having fun in your little kingdom? Oh, <laughs> sorry, I meant to say kingdom, air quotes. Oh, this lavish lifestyle is in my blood, peon. Bask in the glimmer and grace of a true monarch! As the embodiment of opulence, I demand tribute! <laughs> Let's have that essence. I think I'll take that nice crown, too. Okay, you see, that is sort of what I'm ta talking about more with the Plague Knight. That is how a boss fight should go. You t a mad race to see who can do the most damage. Drop the essence into my dynamo the Kender here. Essences are volatile, but my breakthrough design stabilizes them. Once the essences are, are all distilled together, if my risk is correct, then we can craft the ultimate potion! King Knight's essence is ours, and I discovered his crown isn't real cold! <laughs> I knew it! For tender indeed. Well, let's get down to business. So, what are we working on? Well, it's time to do some research. Take a gander at our new arsenal. Oh yeah, lots of new stuff. Uh, let's see. This ki Hmm. Let me think. Uh... Looks up and away when thrown. Arcs into the air, four comes crashing down. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna want that. Uh... I'm gonna want... Let me think. I am a fan of this one. And I can buy the float casing, or I can buy the long fuse. Well, any fuse, really. Uh... Sure, let's go with that. Oh yeah, by the way, wrong button. Four out of four, okay then. Hello, Percy. My ally, that's two sheets of paper! Okay. Yep. <laughs> he was talking? Must have blanked out. Well. That's more money. Uh, let's, uh... I cannot afford anything else. Well, okay then. I guess we'll call it there. It's nice that it puts you directly back into your lab after each level. So, uh, 
Uh, join me next time when we head into the Leash Lard. And t Leash Lard? Yes, the Leash Lard. Until then, this is being Cast Blue, and have a great day. Bye!